Hey, welcome to Comic Book News. I'm Dan Shaheen. Today, we're going to take a look at the new Swamp Thing trailer that just dropped from uh, the DC Universe. It's going to be exclusively on their streaming platform. So, uh, without further ado, let's take a look. And I'm going to keep the chit chat to a minimum until the video is done. Atlanta called. There's a situation back in the States. Where? You're kidding. How long has it been since you were home? A while. We don't know what this is yet. The hospital is on it 24-7 and the CDC. My name is Dr. Abby Arcane. My team is here to find the source of this disease. Body. Dealt with anything like that before? Who are you again? Holland. Al Collin was investigating illegal dumping on the swamp. Hello? Dr. Jason Woodrow. The CDC's in town. There's no way that my accelerant is responsible. There's this poison coming off the swamp. There's been a shift in the balance of the light and the dark. Something's out there. We're dealing with something beyond the known scope of science. I need an alive to study. There is all kinds of awful that happens in this swamp. There's something special about this place. <laughs> There's so much unimaginable beauty out there, Abby. The swamp had enough. This is payback. Wow, that looks pretty creepy, and uh, I see a lot of elements that remind me of the uh, classic Alan Moore Swamp Thing from uh, the late 80s, right? Swamp Thing was uh, labeled as sophisticated suspense, and it was the first time really, really dark, mature themes were explored in a DC comic uh, in, in the way that they were. Um, it's an amazing work of comic book genius it paved the way for vertigo uh there would be no sandman there would be no uh john constantine who made his first appearance in the swamp thing comic um so many things came out of swamp thing uh it, with incredible art by mostly by rick veitch and um, i think john toddleman uh written by alan moore had some of the most amazing uh ideas so what i love about alan moore when he um does a sort of reboot right is he doesn't throw away the past in fact he does the opposite he embraces everything that was in continuity for the character but changes it and makes it make sense in a new way right so everything that you knew about the character is still true like it still happened but not in the way that you think so it's an amazing book i don't know that a tv show can match what we saw out of that comic but uh, it looks like it's on a good start. I see uh, characters like uh, Woodrow. I saw Abby Arcane. Uh, we don't see um, her infamous uncle. But I'm sure that he'll probably make an appearance somewhere along the line. Much like he does in the comics where he's sort of been dead for a while and, 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 and maybe comes back later on. I don't want to spoil anything, but you know I don't have any inside knowledge either. So um, I know I'm looking forward to this. I know uh, I'm not a huge horror fan, but I'm a gigantic Swamp Thing fan, so I'm definitely going to check it out. And, uh, hey, speaking of checking things out, if you like this video, you might like some of my other videos, right? So please check them out. Make sure to like, comment, 
and subscribe and ring that bell if you want notifications about future videos. And hey, thank you for watching and helping this channel grow.